11 Internet Marketing Mistakes You Don't Know You're Making You've finally made the decision to make money online and become an internet marketer. I think you've made a great decision, but did you know there are many mistakes that you could be making and not even know you are making them? This article will highlight 11 common mistakes made by beginners and even some seasoned pros. Find out if you are guilty of making any yourself. Point 11 Internet marketing mistakes Not creating your own website or squeeze page, getting bogged down creating the perfect website assuming that creating an online business will happen overnight. Thinking you can get started for free being under the impression that you will get rich quick, not treating the online business like a real business, not making an email list of prospective customers, not being active every day selling from your squeeze page, trying to use all the traffic generating techniques or methods to get prospects to your site at once not getting training not creating your own website or squeeze page it is possible to pay someone to create your website. By creating your own site, you not only save money you gain insight to the types of problems your prospects could run into, which makes giving them an answer to their questions much easier. Plus you won't be dependent on someone to make changes to your site or upload new content. Remember that you learn by doing getting bogged down creating the perfect website I have to admit that I have been guilty of this. I learned a lot about HTML and CSS, but it took time away from what I should have been doing creating quality content for my visitors. The content is the most important aspect of your site. A simple one-page website is all you need, assuming that creating an online business will happen overnight. An online business is similar to a traditional brick-and-mortar business in that it takes time to build. You can't expect to make money overnight just because you have a website. You need to attract visitors to your site with quality content that is relative to them and this could take weeks or months. Thinking you can get started for free in terms of business startup cost you can't beat internet marketing, you can almost do it for nothing, but there are some necessary startup costs. You're going to need an autoresponder service, which costs about $20 per month. You will need to buy a domain name, which is about $12 to $18 per year. You will need a hosting company to host your website on their servers. Cost is about $60 to $150 per year. It's possible to get a domain name, an autoresponder, and even web hosting for free, but you get what you pay for. Your site will be full of ads, which are not yours. The customer service could be in question, and the autoresponder services don't work in a way that is useful. The bottom line, spend the money and do it right. Being under the impression that you will get rich quick, just as building an online business takes time. Creating wealth also takes quite a bit of time, depending on how much effort you put into the business. If you need money right away, this is not for you. An online business is not a get-rich-quick scheme, and anyone claiming overnight riches is lying to you. Not treating the online business like a real business just because you are working from your home doesn't mean you shouldn't have a work schedule, daily goals, and objectives, just as you would at a traditional business. Making money online is hard work and requires many hours of work each day. Not making an email list of prospective customers The reason internet marketing works is because internet marketers first collect people, email addresses, that are interested in the types of products or services they are selling, even before they have anything to sell. Once the list is large enough, they sell directly to the list. The chances that the prospect buys from the internet marketer is high because they have already shown an interest in the types of products or services by signing up to the email list. Not being active every day The more active you are the more visible your website will be, leading to more traffic to your site which will generate more customers. Write on a blog, a forum, a social media site or create an article every day. You may also want to create videos, ebooks or some other forms of digital media once or twice a week. Create engaging, relevant, and quality content for your prospects. Selling from your squeeze page This is one of the biggest mistakes made. Selling from your squeeze page is a no-no, you want to first create an email list and then sell to the list. Create credibility with your prospect by supplying them with free quality content that is relevant to them, trying to use all the traffic generating techniques or methods to get prospects to your site at once there are so many traffic generating techniques, trying to use all of them at once would be overwhelming and difficult for some. Concentrate on the methods you like and that give you the best results. 
three or four methods are more than enough to get traffic flowing to your site. Not getting training the internet is full of information about how to become an internet marketer. There is so much to sift through and so many scams promising riches that someone just beginning will get swallowed whole by the sheer volume of information. Find someone to teach or mentor you, there are many services to choose from. Before you sign up do some research on the service, look for reviews and testimonials. Do a check of the service at a scam site. A service promising that you will make large sums of money is a red flag, everyone makes mistakes, these 11 mistakes are common to most beginners, don't feel down if you are making them yourself. The great thing about mistakes is that you can learn from them, a mistake today becomes a lesson tomorrow and one you don't have to make ever again.